What's going on, Divine Collective? How are you doing this evening? Oof, y'all ready for your reading, okay? Mm. Let's get into this reading here. Let's start. When are we going to start? I made like this. <laughs> I made this neon deck. It's called the Confessions Deck, okay? The Confessions Deck. It's not that messy, okay? It's not like stink deck. It's not messy like that, but... It might it's some stuff in here that your person might want to tell you. You know what I'm saying? Maybe they haven't told you yet. Okay. Or maybe they have. And we need to go a little deeper into it. Hey. We need to go a little deeper into it. Yeah, so let's get a little deeper into it. Okay. Let's get a little deeper into it. Alright. So <laughs> I'm used to people waiting on me, okay? I'm used to people waiting on me, and maybe you're not waiting on them collective. I got into a fight with him or her, okay? They fighting out here in these streets collective, okay? They out here fighting. Got into a fight. That's probably the ex, okay? I got into a fight with him or her, okay? I'm used to people waiting on me, all right? You know, mm. Mm. tell them you're divine collectors. We don't wait on nobody, okay? Like that, not like that. You know what I mean? Like, how long have you got me? I'm gonna wait. Shit. Grocery store, okay? Y'all need to go to the grocery store, collective, okay? Y'all not going to the grocery store, okay? Somebody's saying, I want answers now, okay? That's probably what that fight was about. Okay, be careful. All right, somebody got in a fight. You need to be careful. Okay, don't put don't don't put nobody in the hospital. Always on my mind though. Somebody's always on there, you know, in, in divine timing. Okay, so this makes sense to me right here. And then we have um, let your guard down for me. Okay, so <clears throat> this right here is telling me that something is supposed to happen in divine timing. Okay, I know this person saying I'm used to people waiting on me, but the fact that they're talking about waiting and I see divine timing, I feel like something that's going on is divine and it's very hard to wait for stuff like that sometimes because you're like you're anxious, you just like would this shit hurry up and happen already? You know, like you're just frustrated, you know, but divine timing came out. So you're always on this person's mind. They obviously care about you and love you. But divine timing is going on over here for somebody who's, you know, waiting or, you know, they're waiting for somebody who says, you know, shit like, oh, I'm used to people waiting on me. <laughs> but you get what I'm saying, collective, with that. I got into a fight with him or her. Somebody wants answers now. Be careful, okay? Let's clarify these. Huh? Birthday deck. What's going on here? What's going on with be careful? I want answers now. Um, I got into a fight with him or her, okay? Oh, man. What's going on? What's going on with this? Be careful. Hmm? Ooh, they was fighting over ooh, a fairy. So this card came out the other day, and I called it, like, my Earth Angel card, okay? Number 30 here. 30 might be significant to you. Okay, could it happen on the 30th or something? All right, so somebody was looking for you, okay? Or some, or somebody saw your person looking at you or looking for you or something like that, okay? Because what they're doing is they're looking for somebody. <laughs> so I always assume that this comes out when there's like an earth angel involved, okay? There's somebody who is like a divine male or female and... You know, you're seeing somebody here, okay? There's a third party. Uh, this is like a third party channel. I have other readings, but like a lot of my stuff is third party, okay? And like karmic stuff. So somebody got into a fight. They wanted answers now. They're saying be careful, okay? And it has something to do with somebody looking at or looking for, okay? Their earth angel, okay? Their other person, but somebody who is very special, okay, not, you know, 
Now, always on my mind, divine timing. What is this here? Okay. Okay, connect with crystals. <laughs> okay. Um, <laughs> now, this could be a name. Okay, it could be like a Christine, Chris. A name with C. Okay. Christina. Something that sounds like crystal. Um, it also means that you should maybe try working with crystals. Okay, they help. Um, maybe you're frustrated right now. Okay, maybe you're frustrated right now. You're waiting for divine timing. And you know this person cares. It's just frustrating right now. Maybe you're supposed to be single and available for this person right now. The name could start with a C. We have crystal here. We have the number 11. 11 is, is, 11, 11 is like twin flame stuff. So, um, <laughs> twin flame stuff. You know, but you know what I'm saying, collective. Okay, 11 is, is, is a twin. Okay, one and one. Okay, so definitely look up that number if it applies to you. And, you know, this person is just trying to find peace while they're waiting, okay? And maybe crystal work will, will help if you haven't done it or if you have them sitting around and you're not using them. Maybe you should try. Maybe it will help you uh, during this time of waiting, this waiting period, okay? But this looks like divinity to me. And again, the name, you know, something that starts with a C, it could be a name, okay? Let's get it. We have we have some special special things going on here, like twin flame, earth angel stuff going on here. So let's get into this. Um, mm, hmm. Let me pull it. I haven't pulled this tarot deck in a while. Let's pull a couple cards from here. Oh, you know what? Let's get um. Let's do an energy check for your person. Okay, give me an energy check for be careful um, I want answers now let me check for this person here what's going on I can't express myself so somebody here in this third party cannot express themselves so they fight okay this is how they deal with stuff that's why it says be careful I want answers now but they don't know how to express that um, they might not be able to express the answers that they need to express or there's some type of miscommunication going on here that caused the fight. Okay. Number three and number 30. Okay. Always on my mind. Divine timing. Connect with crystals. What's going on with this person's energy here? Hmm. If I could go back, I would handle this differently. Okay, so this person is a little regretful. Okay, something happened. Okay, you, you've probably been seeing each other for a few months or some time here. Okay, there's some type of history here. Because they say they can go back. So they did some time in the past here. They want to try it again. Okay, but they're, they're all, you know, you're always on their mind. They could work with crystals or maybe you, you know, you can or should. Okay. Let's get into tarot here. Let's see here. Oh, check. Mm. <laughs> All right. So, yeah. Something happened. Yeah. So, you're their Ace of Cups collective. Okay. You could have water in your chart. All right, something happened here, King of Swords, energy in reverse. All right, so there was some uh, manipulation taking place. And that's why um, they wish they can go back, okay? Somebody was manipulating them when it came to your relationship. They were being manipulated in the background. Could be by air energy, okay? Negative air energy, not positive air energy, okay? Hmm. But somebody was manipulating them and being very cruel, okay? And it caused them to um, handle you, handle your relationship in a particular way, okay? But now you're always on their mind and they do have some type of expectation of you waiting on them, you know? Like, they're expecting you to wait for them. But this says that it's divine timing. So it's not like you're waiting on them collective, you're waiting on divine timing. It's like, that's what I'm getting from here, okay? So... It's up to you just because something is divine 
doesn't mean you have to go with the collective it's just what it is you know um the sun card in reverse is here so it caused some depression here somebody is sad okay sun card in reverse somebody is feeling sad somebody's avoiding conflict okay so this is confirmation that a fight ha happened because this is fighting <laughs> all right so somebody's avoiding it all right they're trying to avoid this person it could have fire in their chart okay we got fire here water all right somebody's yeah so you know this was about money okay this fight was about money and as you see we have pentacles here somebody is deciding and feeling overwhelmed about a decision to give somebody money okay and they can't express themselves about it okay somebody wanted answers about money they could owe somebody money but they're saying to be careful okay um yeah two of pentacles in reverse says i'm overwhelmed okay and this this fight threw my balance off that's why i'm trying to avoid it here the five of wands in reverse okay and we have four of pentacles here in reverse which is, which is um this person is, is being very stingy okay with their money they don't want to give this person money and it caused a fight okay somebody can't express themselves properly okay it also has something to do with the earth angel somebody's mad about a third party they're mad about money they're mad about several things with this person and this person is just you know the cards are just saying just to be careful and they're doing the right thing they're avoiding the conflict which is this other person so this other person could have uh, air and fire in their chart okay this is a general tarot reading it's not a personal reading all right Let's see what else is going on here. Collective. Open a different deck. Okay. What else does Divine Collective need to know about this situation here? Some, but this is this is good somebody is um when it comes to this fight and not being able to express himself holding on to their money looking at the earth angel looking at the other person somebody w maybe walked in or something okay i want answers now this person is releasing this this is sword energy here okay we have confirmation of some sword energy okay gemini libra or aquarius in the background here the other person and it's an eight of, eight of swords in reverse, all right? So this person is, is uh, they want freedom, okay? They're taking their freedom, okay? They're accepting what's going on here. They're trying to look at things with a new perspective. And somebody has a problem with that, okay? Somebody has a problem with them being free, okay? They want to bind this person. They want this person to be binded, okay? As you can see, they want to be free and they're not free here. But they want to be free okay they're 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 they, they're working on freedom or they are free okay maybe that's why the fight happened because somebody's fighting for their freedom some type of fight okay now this queen of wands here in the middle all right queen of wands is hanging out um she's very determined and she's very passionate okay we have we do have fire energy here in the center so we don't want to just hanging out in the middle she's in the middle of these two people here we have Sagittarius energy here. Okay, we have Queen of Wands energy here. We have fire uh, with the, the X could be an air sign. Okay, we have water. Okay, somebody could have water in their chart as well. It's fire. We got a lot of fire here. It's a very fiery situation going on. Okay, a lot of passion. Could be some sex going on here. Um, could be a recovering alcoholic going on here. Somebody's trying to recover from alcoholism. Um, somebody's trying to balance themselves out. They're working on becoming a balanced person, a tempered person for the Queen of Wands in the center who is caught in the middle of this. It could be Leo in your chart. Okay. Maybe Virgo. Okay. All right. What else is going on here? Yeah, this, this, yeah, okay. 
So this person wants a Ten of Pentacles life with this Queen of Wands. Okay? That's what they want. Okay? And this situation here that happened with the ex uh, could have left your person in need. Okay? There's a Five of Pentacles here. They, they're they're kind of needy. Okay? They have needs. And they're trying to fulfill them, I guess. Okay? And they're doing that by balancing their temper. Okay? This person might have been balanced. Okay? So they're trying to, you know... Balance it. They know that they have to balance their temperance to get out of this poverty, back to this Ten of Pentacles life that they want. Okay, and this is this right here, this fight on the left side here over the Earth Angel, the third party. There's no completion here. Somebody ghosted somebody. Okay, that's my ghosted card. The world card is just incomplete. All right, there's no closure here. Okay, I don't know if this person cares. I'm getting the feeling they don't really care about this third party anymore. It's just been going on for a while. Okay, they're just being careful right now. They know this person is dangerous, okay? Reverse sword energy could be violent as a sword, okay? So it could be violence going on. So this person, and you know, look at this visual here, okay? This individual here, okay? There's, there's something going on here, all right? It has something to do with money, okay? There's a few pentacles here on, 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 on. fighting over money, okay? Somebody's demanding money, okay? Somebody's saying no. I want freedom from this debt, from this whatever you think I owe you or whatever I you know owe you or don't owe you. They don't want to pay it. They, they, they're holding on to their money. And somebody keeps fighting for it. Um, hmm. Let's pull a positive card here. We'll pull some other decks. Okay. Okay. God in the universe, hear my prayers. Okay, number 33. All right. God in the universe came my prayers. You have to know that. You have to know that. Okay. So maybe these people need to do some prayers, have some faith in whatever they believe in, and, you know, ask something else to intervene. And sometimes you have to reach out to your ancestors or whatever you um, reach out to when times are hard. Sometimes you need to do that. Let's see what else uh, needs to come out here from your person. Okay. All right. What else does divine person want to say to them? Okay. Clarify some of this here. really feeling embarrassed to tell you this okay I'm really feeling embarrassed to tell you this there's something that this person is really ashamed of why won't you talk to me okay so that's probably the other the third party here they're not talking to them all right they ghosted the, the world cards in reverse there's no closure why won't you talk to me because you're fighting me for money that's why okay <laughs> you're beating me up all kind of shit's going on this person's in the five of pentacles now okay they're fucking with their ace of cups they love all right they're messing with their shit Okay, I'm really feeling embarrassed to tell you this. They're embarrassed to tell you something collective. Whatever's going on beyond this reading, they're embarrassed about it. They're feeling embarrassed. Okay? But they just say you're always on their mind all the time. They're always thinking about you. And this is divine timing. There's a reason why all this is happening. That's why it says God in the universe hear my prayers because God in the universe is involved in this. This involves God in the universe. That's why that card came out to remind you. Okay? They hear you praying. Somebody was in jail. Okay? I don't know who that is. Let's see. Let's clarify who was in jail. Let's talk about it a little bit. Okay? Let's talk about it a little bit. Terrified in the jail is going on here. Terrified was in jail. All right, King of Wands was in jail. Yeah. And this is what they was doing in there. <laughs> okay. 
King of Wands is trying to see the bigger picture right now. Okay, they're overcoming these challenges. Okay, but we have a fire energy that was in jail. Okay. Um, and they're working very hard right now. Uh, they're setting high standards, higher standards than they were uh, in the past. And I think that's going to help this person not end up in a situation again. I think maybe they were they were not doing the right things when it came to their, their money. Okay, they're, they're, they want to have more diligence. I guess that's what they learned after uh, being in jail. Okay. Now, the in jail could be spiritual jail. It could be physical jail. It could be jail in this relationship, okay? But it's some type of jail that this person was in, okay? Mm. Clarify with a jail. Again, clarify King of Wands, eight of coins. Mm. Wow. Damn. Clear as day. I am in two relationships. I am in two relationships. That's the jail collection collection collective <gasps> two relationships with water and air possibly okay let's clarify this relationship here this uh love is card on the right clarify the love is card please what's the status of the love is card mm. oh there's somebody's not talking to somebody somebody goes to somebody but, uh, let me see here Mm. <sighs> yeah somebody uh wants freedom from this relationship okay somebody wants to explore and they want to explore other paths in this relationship they don't want to be with this person no more they're looking away from it they want to take their wand somewhere else see the back is turned to it they're no longer interested that's the jail that they maybe were in okay clarify two of cups please could have virgo and leo here water Clarify two of cups, please. Okay. So, yeah, they are focused on this relationship here. They're looking towards it. Okay. Could have Virgo for sure. I definitely uh, verify that. Okay. This is a general reading now. Okay. Not for any personal person here. Um, but this person is, they're contemplating and they're, they're trying to gain awareness and insight into this two of cups relationship. We have ace of cups and two of cups so this water energy that they're interested in that's always on their mind okay could have fire in the chart as well all right um yeah somebody's not talking to somebody somebody goes like confirmed with you know why you're not talking to me ghosting world card incompletion somebody is avoiding the conflict all kinds of confirmation that this is not going on this page one is looking the other way they want freedom okay page one is about freedom i want freedom we have jail a jail card freedom okay this person's in jail with this uh an energy here okay yeah and they're really interested okay in this other person here they're trying to gain insight they're trying to become a better person for this this two of cups ace of cups energy Okay, the, the, you know, I'm getting there was some issues in their last relationship. Okay. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Let me get white deck. Uh. All right, white deck. A couple of cards for the Divine Collective here. What is to come for this relationship here? This on the, on the left. Okay. The Hermit card, always on my mind. Connect with crystals. Um, I'm really feeling embarrassed to tell you this. What's going on here? Okay, somebody dropped out of school and didn't tell you collective, okay? I can't be trusted. Mmm. Mmm. Mind your business? That's what they're saying. <laughs> They're telling somebody to mind a business, okay? This is this is the energy here, okay? So I can't be, your person can be saying I can't be trusted. They could be feeling like this, okay? Remember, I'm really embarrassed to tell you something, okay? Um, this person is, is the, the hermit card means this person is trying to change and evolve. Okay, maybe they can't be trusted or maybe this other party can't be trusted. Maybe they both can't trust. They're not trustworthy people because but this person loves you. 
Okay, this person might have lied to you in the past, but you still love them, you forgive them. They're telling this person to mind their business. They're saying, mind your business. Okay, somebody's saying, mind your business. They're not talking to you, collective. Obviously, they're not talking to you. But this energy here is very aggressive. It likes to jump into the readings. X energy in my readings are very aggressive, okay? They like to, they like to be, you know, mm -hmm. yeah. Wedding plan. So I got mind your business wedding plan. Mind your business about my wedding plan. Okay, so it's possible that this person is making plans. Okay, mind your business, they said. Stop, stop getting in my business. But it, I'm getting that this person is still somewhat attached. It might be a divorce finalizing or something. Something is in the works, but this, it doesn't, it's still in an upright, but this person wants freedom from it. Okay, they don't, they, they're not talking to this person, they're separated. Okay, they could be legally separated right now. That's what I'm thinking. Okay, something like that. Mm-hmm. I'll never marry you. Okay. Fearing change. I got my own money. All right, so they just... Kukaracha has to come out and talk. All right? I got my own money. It could be your person. Somebody's got their own money, though. Okay? Somebody's got their own money. That makes me think, like, why are you... Somebody's asking for money and they got their own money. Let's clarify. This person could be fearing change. They don't. Both of them could be fearing change because somebody don't. You know, might not be able to move on. But somebody's saying, "I can't let you go." Okay. I can call you, but I'm not over here. I can call you, but I'm not. Why won't you talk to me? They don't want to call this person anymore. I'm not calling you. I can call you, but I'm not calling you. I'm, I'm sick and tired of you. You're a fucking bitch. I'm sorry, because that's the energy. That's the energy. This person, they, they don't like each other. Okay, there's fighting going on here. This, this, this person won't leave him alone. But they're trying to have freedom. Then. Okay, I was in jail. This is a person describing this relationship as jail. I just saw a ton of swords. Okay, in the, in the deck. Okay, clarify, I got my own money. I'm going to clarify, wedding plan, and I got my own money. Okay, collective. Mm. Yes, fighting. <laughs> okay, so this is the conflict right here. So the conflict has their own money. Okay. I don't know what they're telling you. I don't know what this ex is telling you, collective. I don't know who's watching this. But this person is saying the, the conflicted person. Okay, the one that's the conflict that this person is trying to avoid. Five of Wands came out in reverse. They're avoiding this. Confirmation, this is Five of Wands. Five of Wands confirmed. That person is the conflict. This person is avoiding. This person, the conflicted person, has, has their own money. Okay? So I don't know what they're telling you. I don't know what they're telling you, but they got their own money. What I'm getting is that they want yours and theirs. They being cheap as fuck. They fear and change. They want to keep taking from you. They want to keep taking from you. They can't be trusted. That's who can't be trusted. This person here, they're lying to you. They're telling you they don't have no money. That bitch got a stash. This is a general reading. Okay, that's my disclaimer. Hmm. Wedding plan here. Clarify wedding plan. Clarify wedding plan. Okay. Somebody's thinking about it. Somebody's daydreaming and manifesting a wedding plan with water energy. Okay, they oh this three party this three party business is finished. Okay, maybe something happened. They were planning something with some people. So they planning something and something maybe something didn't go right. Okay, maybe I got mind your business. Okay, so maybe this person was, was getting in between the wedding plan with this group here and now it's in reverse. There was conflict, okay? There was disorganization. It might have had something to do with this person. So they're saying, mind your business. I'm trying to plan something. I've got something on my mind. Okay, this person wants to move on with this individual. Okay, they, the page of cups is about a happy surprise. Okay, all right. It's about something that they're very sensitive about. This is this this wedding plan. They're very sensitive about it, collective. 
okay and somebody was minding their business and caused some type of conflict in the plan they were planning something and now it's not you know it, they this person and interfered with it they said mind your business you conflicted psycho you know shit what else does the divine collective need to know about this situation here okay somebody wants to be very generous to their queen of pentacles okay so we have queen of wands and queen of pentacles so we have earth and fire queens here in an upright position and somebody wants to be generous to you okay i read this card other ways depending on what's in the spread okay but the spread is positive there's not many kukarachas here okay hmm. i don't get the impression this person is being generous to the kukarachas okay i don't think so and um this person is, is sharing they want to share with the queen of pentacles they want to share their life they want to share their fortune with the queen of pentacles it could be why the wedding plans were happening that this person that they want to be with could have a uh, fire and earth in their chart and water okay or air i mean or both or three or two or you know whatever your chart is but there's a combination of elements here but if it resonates with you it resonates with you Okay, this earth here, this earth and fire heavy. Okay, and we have water energy too. They all you you all could have these elements, but definitely air. The X is air. Okay, all right, collective. That is your reading.